Uh, if you watched the end of last stream, well, not end of it, but like toward the end of it, maybe when Z and Kara and I were running co-op vaults together, I managed to slam down three vaults in a row and I netted 19,000 experience off of it and basically leveled twice from those three vaults. Uh, I hit up Iskel afterwards and I had talked about it a little bit on stream. This is what people were referencing of like asking Iskel to uh, draw my level back a little bit, which I don't think is an issue, honestly. Iskel, I talked to him, I was like, hey, I don't think that you should get the same level of experience for lower level vaults, because if you're a higher level and you go into a low level vault from just people you're cooperating with, not only are you going to blast through levels when vaults are significantly easier to run, both scavenger and boss killing, but also you're probably going to wind up over leveling when you don't want to, because like I boosted two levels, which made my vaults more difficult and i didn't really get any gear from the two vaults that i ran i mean i got loot but i didn't really get like unidentified gear and what i did get was basically not useless just not ideal so he was like yeah it's not a bad pitch and he's going to be implementing something at least i think they were discussing it he said they were discussing it in dev i don't know what's actually going to go on patch but there's going to be something where if you are a higher level and you go into a lower level vault you'll get a percentage of experience that you would normally get relative to how large the level gap is between vaults. And I think it's a really, really good idea um, for both those reasons of like not screwing yourself over and also not leveling unfairly because at that point, like why would you want to try and run your own vaults when you can just level like crazy from lower vaults? So um, he also mentioned that it's not really an issue for lower level, like lower level people going in with higher level people they would still like get the same amount of experience and everything like that like he said yeah it's it's an issue in the way that you're presenting it for higher levels for lower levels it, they're fine like everything like that should be pretty much pertained so we'll see what actually makes it out in the patch notes whenever that gets updated but that's kind of like a general thing because i don't really want to get 7,000 experience for killing a boss that does a fraction of the amount of damage to me than a level 17 vault so yeah even with like item quantity and item quality from a higher level can really make power loving the low level people a lot easier. I don't think it's really the lower level people that are the issue. It's just the higher level people running in lower level vaults that uh, we were like, yeah, it's probably not a good idea to get equal experience. So, yeah. That was the conversation of like, you know, should I take my levels back? And I don't think that was really an issue. Like I have the experience, not that big of a deal. It's still extremely early game. So, yeah. So here's the actual, um, here's the actual thing that I wanted to do today. I've got two skill points and I was considering putting that into haste whenever we can bump up two levels because I think haste two is really nice. Also, what kind of surprises me is the, I thought these were all level 50 for the third tier of these, but you can actually get haste three at level 20 if you wanted to spend more than half of your skill points on haste purely. Which I think is interesting because as an axe player that could really help out DPS. And I was valuing haste higher than strength because haste naturally will increase your damage output, kind of like strength, but it also helps with spawners and mining and overworld stuff. There's a lot of reasons why it's better than strength. And also, I'm probably going to be brewing up some strength two pots to bring into the vault. So if I do get around to wanting to fight a boss, I'll be able to output heavy damage. But I was thinking about it and. I've been rocking heal three for a while now. Pretty much the entire server is. But I've noticed that I'm getting to a point where I'm still getting knocked down a ton of experience and then I lose all my mana and need to heal a ton. And I was thinking... I was doing a little stinking. What if... What if I respect back into fortune, mine through a few more ores, including the black opal, and tried making a skill point and maybe dump the cheeky three points into heal to see what heal six looks like. Because if you guys weren't around when we first discussed this, the problem with upgrading heal past three is that heal four becomes not as viable if you're talking about just being able to heal a ton, like super frequently if you're very low on HP and you're just healing whenever your mana regenerates. Because this is four seconds additional of cooldown and nearly double the mana cost for only one extra heart. This isn't worth it. So we were talking, well, let me clarify. It can be worth it if you're only gonna heal like twice. But if you're trying to heal any more than twice, 
then it's not worth it at all. The repeated heals are better at level 3, which I don't know if it's something that they're planning on fixing, but there's a couple of skills like that where it's just better uh, until it gets to one point where it changes a little bit, and then it starts becoming better again. But I don't know what's past this. And I'm kind of sick of not figuring that out. So I'm going to chuck probably three levels into heal. And I might very well regret it because I don't know what heal five and six and I guess even seven looks like. So it could be pretty bad, but I'm praying that upgrading heal past three has some value in it somewhere. Which also leads me to say that I do really like the fact that you don't know what the future levels of talents are going to be until you actually level up and can only see the next one. I don't know if they've talked about changing that at any point, but I, yeah, I oddly like that. I don't know. It gives you a little bit to try and explore. And it's like, you're not going to know this right off the bat. You got to kind of invest a little bit before you're just told right away. So, yeah. Anyway. probably in the config files well let me throw out the second part of this the public release has still not gone out yet so we get to live in bliss for a little bit longer ignorant bliss for a little bit longer so i can say these things and not have 17 people tell me actually fuck you here's how it is uh fuck your gaming experience i don't care if you get spoiled so for anybody telling me oh iskal said this shut up let me play the game. Let me have some fun, man. Where my fortune pick? There it is. Alright. So what do we have in terms of ores? Two black opal, six pay knight, three gorge knight, four wooded eye, uh, one bombing knight, one astium, one pizza knight, one escalium, one sparkle team. Alright, pretty good. I'm sorry, that was aggressive. Can I post a picnic day for you guys to as an apology. I'm sorry for being allowed. That was that was a bit out of that was a bit out of me. No notification? Shaman, what you talking about? For stream? Thirty eight off of that thirteen ore? Shit. I think this is 26 Laramar ore. Also, I'm doing it from under. Don't ask me why. That wasn't very good. That was a lot better. Yeesh. <laughs> okay. A lot better pull on the Benetite than Laramar, I think. What did I? Four ore? Nine. Okay, not bad. Lexandrite? Don't remember how much ore. 13, I think, maybe. Not bad at all. Hi, Pay Knight. Six of you. Please, at least 12. Okay, it's not extremely good by any means, but it's also not bad. 16 off of six. That's, that's really not that bad of a return, to be honest with you. Gorge Knight. Three off of six. Thank God I've gotten a ton of you. Uh, I'll just, I'm gonna save a black opal until last. Bombing night, one ore, one gem, Ashium, one gem, Sparkleton, four gems. Thanks, Jordan. Scalium, five gems. Damn. How am I feeling today? All right. Fuck me, I guess. That's good. Okay. All right. Whew. The black couple was literally what I needed. <laughs> like that's, that was the entire reason that I did all of this. Thank Christ alive. Okay, good. Five from two is there's, it's not 10, but it is definitely not zero. That is a very, I, that's a respectable return. Okay. So we are sitting on eight black opal. So I think, uh, there's not really a reason why I wouldn't do this. Unless I don't have Benetite crafted. Embarrassing, to say the least, bud. Kind of embarrassing, my guy. Give me that extraordinary Benetite. Thank you. And give me... 
my ore frame. Ooh. And give me my skill orb. Oh. Ooh. Nice. And we still have enough skill shards to be able to make another one if we wanted to. So we could double up on... Or we could get a four right now because we have the Benetite. We do have four more Black Opal. We'd be out of Black Opal at that point, but we procced five and we had three, so... We could, but in the meantime, I don't know what heal six is going to offer, but I think I'm pretty dead set on it. Show me what you got for me at this level. So 10 second cooldown, 35 mana, heal six. Eight second cooldown, 30 mana, heal six. Six second cooldown, 25 mana, heal six. Okay. So little investment, but we now heal three hearts. Same cooldown, and our mana got upped by five. So it's a quarter of the mana extra, but for an additional half as much health. And then the next level is a 10 second cooldown, 40 mana, so not 35, 40 mana for eight. So if it's scaling in the right way, then I would assume it would be at level 9, 6 second cooldown, 30 mana, 8 heal, which would also be worth it in that point. Because if you compare, what would it be, level 9 compared to level 3, double the amount of health for half of the additional mana. Because it goes from 20 mana to 30 mana, but you're doing 4 hearts instead of 2 hearts. This is an interesting way of scaling, because it's not just like... And I, I kind of like it, because it's not just like you max out heal from the beginning, from the get-go. Like, you just max out heal at level 12, level 13, and you can just heal all of your health in five seconds with, like, no mana cost. It's like, you shouldn't do this right away, but like, and it'll be better, but it's not going to make you stupidly overpowered. It's a very gradual progression, and doing it in increments of three does seem to be really worth it. So, okay. I guess we'll hang on to the, this for a little while. Probably not upgrade for a bit, because I'll want to focus on haste first. But yeah, we'll wait another... Until we have another batch of three, and then we'll have heal eights for 30 mana at six cooldown, assuming. And what would that be at max? Heal 10 for 35 mana? 35 mana, heal five hearts? That's not bad, you know? That's pretty good. Am I missing anything? I'll find out when I'm in there. A vanilla vault with four robes. Okay. I would like to fight a boss then in that case. I mean, I came as prepared as I possibly could be. We're going south. Unless it's a different... Unless it's one of these. We get to test out the heal as well, too. Also a little coin stash or something like that. I'm not really interested in looting too much else. We got our magnet on. Perfect. I'll always stop for a bit of currency, you know? Red sand for panning? True, actually. Yeah, south facing ball. If y'all could remember that, that'd be great. Oh, there's a two block height right there. We won't gamble then. I run some gambles at some point tonight. I just didn't feel like doing it for this fall for some reason. Uh, don't know what you are, but there's nothing in here. It's funny because I just talked to Iskal last night about how much better vaults felt to just explore every single room in a vault. <laughs> uh, and here I am. Oh. Oh. Oh, there's a beefy POI. That was a lot of fucking damage. What the shit? How in Christ am I taking this much damage right now? Yeah, new heal's good, by the way. Hey guys, we're gonna, um, my Bubba spawner right now. 
I don't think so. It's an altar for the objective as well, too. Not an ob. God oh, dang it. You good? I'm getting by. How you doing? Just out here, just out here surviving, you know? Just out here surviving. Those are both ambush. Yeah, we got a lot going on over here. Also, I'm gonna say this now. If anybody sees me missing regret nuggets, which are those tiny little red nuggets inside of chests, please, for the love of God, do not let me do that. What the shit, man? That is so much damage from a single husk. Like, just don't get hit, forehead, but Christ alive, man. How am I on this OHP? Thank you. Ooh. I might want to start making those uh, safe zone little bits. Another ambush. So many ambush. Are you time alter? What is this room? This room's got so much loot in it, man. So many good chests. What the? I thought for a second it didn't kill it. I didn't see the uh, particles. Not gonna let creepers take out two people today. Tell you what. Um, you know what? Honestly, no, I don't think so. Alters just at the moment do not seem worth it with the loot that they give. And if I want to complete this vault, I would like to have a chance of it. Like, I don't know, three minutes is a considerable time to get other stuff that could be a little bit more useful than just whatever that contains. Even if we don't wind up completing a, uh, a vault. That's just my feeling on it. Oh, and we have a square vault. Nice. Good with me. Alright, we're going west, so I gotta head east to get back home. Write that shit down, man! Uh, you got any ores up there? You got a woo to die. I don't have too many of those, to be honest. Oh, hello. <laughs> Level 1 dash with jumping is insane, man. It's actually crazy. Where's the spawner? Oh god, I don't know where it is. Hey, buds. Is that from up there? I do want that Wutodi. That's all for me. Unless? Yeah, I'm good. See, I wouldn't want to be you. Kill altar next to a spawner. Let's see if you're ambush or not. You're not ambush. Interesting. Okay. Well, I guess that... Like, that... That works. Honor? Oh, it's six down. No, it's five. It's five down there. Was it an ambush? That was an ambush, I think. I don't freaking know, man. Yeah, piercing is pretty good, you know? Regret nuggets. Yeah, I'm trying to be better about my hands this way tonight. Piercing's pretty. <laughs> Piercing's pretty good. 
Piercing's not a bad thing to have. Hello there. Hello there. I'll be departing. Thank you for your time and your patronage. I'm out of here. May also get extra alt XP from the ulcer chest compared to others. Yeah, that's a thing too. See that one cheeky little gilded on that balloon there. Doesn't seem the easiest to obtain right now, so I'll pass on that. 28 degrees in Tennessee. I think it's about how temperature is now. It's 17 degrees here. Oh, a third one of you. Are we? Are we actually doing? I'm not going to lie to you. I'm like, I'm terrified of the concept of it, but I'm also like a little excited for it because you know what? Sometimes you just got to say, fuck it, dude. To clarify, that was fuck it, not fuck it. There's a very, very big difference when uh, applying that terminology to situations. Have to know which one you're talking about. Portal room? Yeah, baby! I think that's a portal room. That would be uh, straight in the lava. Yeah, that would be what that is. Okay. Alright, what's more common now? No, I don't think so. I think we, um... I was like, where are my eyes a vendor? I think we just got, like, pretty lucky. Just get lucky, you know? Like... Um... Wait. Where's the eye that I need to... I'm turned around, I see. Hoggers. All right. There is some junk in my inventory, please, and thank you. Okay, move that around. Thank you much. Should hopefully not be an issue. Should hopefully not be an issue. I shouldn't be doing that. That can spawn uh, not desirable things on top of me. Okay, okay, okay. What the quit with the hops? The angle you're getting is so good for you. All right, that's good enough for me. Cool, got some food out of there. Not bad. Oh, yeah, nearly lost my life. <laughs> kind of forgot about the that part of things. I think we're good. I think we're good. All right, nice little pit stop. That would be a good opportunity, or that would be a unique situation where fear, taunt fear, would be very good. And what is it? Nova freeze would not be. Because I was talking about that I think if I was going to choose either in a situation that was I need to get out of, that I'd prefer Nova freeze. But Nova freeze would freeze the mobs in you and they'd still be able to attack you. Fear would let them not attack you. So at the very least, you could water bucket out in time during the couple of seconds where they're just in your body. So yeah. We're going west, I believe, I'm pretty sure. What mouse do you use? I use a Razor Death Adder V2 Hyperspeed. Experience Alter and Living Chess. Just kind of jumped into that.
Mystery box. Hello, you guys. Um, I don't know what's down there. I don't really care at the moment. I'm on three out of four obelisks, and I definitely want to be able to get to the boss room. I want to be able to get to the boss room, clear out any spawners, and get my mana up before I fight. That would be an ideal thing. Oh, boy. Did I not speak of it? I'm clearing out this entire room before I fight the boss. Because I want to make sure no matter where I run around that I have safe spaces some everywhere. And by clear out, I also do mean loot. That's unfortunate for me. They're dropping from the walls. What the... Uh, okay, that's good. That's good. Doing this now will also give me time to run away if it really is too big of a problem. Hey, bud. Where did you come from? Dude, there's no way it's 104% movement speed. Stack on the new spawners. They're significantly better and they make vault running much, much, much better. I don't think I'll be going up. Well, actually, no, it's literally not sure. The vault, the boss could very well just go up. So, uh, it's not exactly the case. Mm. Oh, God damn. Back off of me. Off of me now. Is that a regular spawner? I pretty God, it wasn't. It was not good, not looting the rest. The actual boss? I didn't even click the obelisk and the boss spawned? What the fuck, devs? New heal is pretty good. That's a rune I'm allowed to have. Oh my. Me oh my. Janning is very, very cool. All right. I think that's everything. Maybe not completely underneath here. Hold on a second. Pause, pause, pause. Pending, pending. Now we've already, we've already gotten all this. Yep, that's the whole room. That is the entire room cleared. Did you get skeleton above you? Don't say those things, man. Don't be saying that. Uh, so we got to evac out that way. Hopefully this isn't too bad. Uh, let's clear up our inventory entirely. Strength pot should hopefully be the only one we need to use. And we could do... On these two? No, not that one. I want to make sure I have my weapons still. 
Yeah, we could have the healing pots there, I think would be fine. We'll move this out. Okay. Full health, full everything. Let's uh see how this goes, yeah? This could go really badly, but fuck it, dude. So, like, you do hurt. You do hurt a good bit. Oof. Oh? I don't do that. What the fuck? You cheeky motherfucker. Ah! Oh my god. Ah! You still have so much HP and I hate you? Oh, because the fucking regen. God damn it, man. Fucking blessed, this guy deals a lot of HP. Oh, fucking shit. Not letting you reach in. Fuck you, reach in. God damn it. Maybe running in. Oh, I'm charging in and getting hit. The fucking reach in on this dude is so bad. God damn it, man! Hey! Back off my ass! What the fuck are you doing there? Get my mana back! Uh see you later, buddy. Alright, we gotta reassess. We gotta reassess. I forgot how quickly the boss heals. Fuck, man. Because what was happening was I was doing like... So you got to kind of play the back off thing that you do with the... Uh, what's it called? Oh, wait a minute. I need to go over this way. Um, I need to do the back off strat that I do in the champion arena, which I think was going well at the beginning. Hey, bud. It was going well at the beginning. The problem is, though... The five second heal was more than I could account for. And so what would happen is I would like drink a heal pot to reheal myself up and everything. And then I'd like run into him to very quickly try and get a hit in before the heal proc. And then I would get hit in as a result. So yeah, I just got to approach bosses a little bit differently. Chad, it was east to get back home, right? South facing vault is to get back home. I should be behind the portal room right now. I did travel east. I pray. That's the back of the vault. Yeah, it's the back of the spawn. Cool. The region window is so fast. Yeah, it's five seconds of not getting hit. Well, the bad news is that we didn't kill the boss. The good news is we didn't lose our life. So you know what? Hey, regain, go next. So the biggest downside is losing the, uh... <laughs> probably losing the six healing potions, but also uh, I need to get a better hot bar slot management for health pots because having that one on slot three and having to tab into my inventory, not super ideal. When I'm jittery and like that, Trying to get the health pot out, not really a very successful task. Is leeching a thing this season? Rampage has a leech option, but it's kind of brutal on... It's a little bit brutal on your mana. I think someone was saying this guy was talking about using, like, Rampage and... Some combination for leech or something like that, but yeah, anyway. Alright. Hey, we got some good stuff at the very least. Could've been worse. Low experience vault. Splash potions take a pog to make. Yeah. Ugh, I need to look into that. Splash potions worth it. Pogs are lingering. I think splash potions are just yeah. So we'd want splash potions over drinkable. I should have made this. That's just an oversight. We'll make these uh we'll make some splash potions of healing 
for the next one. Now I'm only down to two gapples, so I'll need to make some more gapples as well, too. All right. You know what? Hey, not bad. Um, we were doing damage before the regen. Like, we were getting some hits in. We just have to deal with the fact that we got to be able to sustain better. It's good. All right. You're... Boss or scav? Boss? Well... We're gonna find out whether that affects the boss or not. <laughs> uh, I'm sending this bitch, by the way. I don't care. Give me my money. What kind of shoes this dude got on? Oh, relax, man. Don't spawn a sub fighter. Thank you. Does it tower? Yo, but Opal, never much of the five gifted. It's very kind of you. Thank you so much. Um, I think that's good down here. Yeah, that's good. Oh, fuck. This dude's a genius. <laughs> nice health, bud. All right, he's facing vault. Shit! It's your room! Whoop. Yo, thanks for the room, guys. Understandable. Understandable. Don't need those. Well, not a whole heck of a lot going on there, huh? Oh. Oh, hey. Give me that. Any gold down here? Golden chests are pretty good too, you know what I mean? I mean, the loot was... There's nothing in the middle here, right? Yeah. The loot was okay. But let me tell you. If it's one thing that I love more than good loot, it's free loot. You missed the ore thing up top, by the way. Oh, did I? Fuck, I actually want to go back for that. Oh. I don't even look it up there. Genius. Oh, yeah, because there's one tiny-ass bulb up there. Could be opal copium. You know what? Over under. One opal. Some uh, bullshit in this room. Shall y'all suck it, building? The 
flip me off. You scam me. Fuck you. Is it Derby Green Mustard? I think Gloucester is Pickering the Pog now, so I don't know. Yeah. Pickering is more of an overworld thing now, huh? I mean, it's probably still useful for clearing out some things in a vault. Just it can't be used for any, like, you know, non-basic block now, pretty much. All right, we're going north. Got to go south to get back home. Hello, worst room in the game. Is this room going to get, like, adjusted at some point? Because what the fuck just spawned in front of me? Are you kidding me, dude? How? You you have compressed blocks, and you spawn nine mobs, and I barely even step my foot through the door. There is no reality where that room is balanced at all. That actually needs to get adjusted, because that is, like, terrifying to run through. I had that one vault where I, like, got... Well, that was actually a crystal room, but point still stands. Imagine it wasn't a crystal room, though. Okay, yeah, yeah, just deal like a thousand damage. Compressed mobs. <laughs> I don't care about those coins. There was a spider there and I wanted to get out. There was a spooter. Spooter in the way. I thought that was my thing. See out there in the hallway? I thought that I had like put something further back. I'm like, am I going backwards somehow? This guy? Oh, hey there. Oh, hi there. Duh, what's up there? Okay, how far did you follow me? the way, Jason. Okay. Man, I love giving three hearts of my life for eight ninths of a diamond. Pickering is still good for the architect vaults with floating items. Pepe laugh. Chat, don't tell them. I'm slipping a lot right now, I'll be honest with you. Okay, well, that's just a little bit too much danger for my blood. What? It's the same spider? Oh, shit. We can all calm down. It's exactly what we can do right now. God, I love having speed, too. Look at this evac speed, dude. Holy shit. You are not getting up these stairs, except for the people who do. Look at you looking over there. How about some juicy ores? Wow. I'll be taking those back, thank you. That's a lot of gold. That's an obelisk as well. I guess the nice thing about Cleave is that I can hit more than just three mobs in total. So that's pretty cool. Good amount of cash in this vault. I don't know how it's looking for completing the objective, though, but... Just go down, you little bitch. Just 
funky ass. Please don't be trapped in this exact moment in time. Thank you. Bless. My god, there's so much cash! Oh, man. What? What was that movement? That was insane. From where? Son of a bitch! I was gonna take five years, give me a little bit. That's why I was gonna proc while I'm mining it, I already know, so I'm just gonna wait for a spawn to happen. Come on. Yep, immediately. You know, like, that just should not be able to happen. Worth the coins? Oh yeah, look at these fat piles. Are you kidding me? Seven-piecer? Three-piecer? Five-piecer? Another five-piecer? Oh my god. What is down here? Oh my god! You rich, rich. Believers, I, I need you to understand that, uh... You, in this position, you would do the same. But, like, still only two obs needed, you know what I mean? Believers, um, here's the thing. Um, here's the, here's the thing. It's the, the daily X mark. You understand? Where there's money to be made, money must be made. That looked different for some reason. Hey, uh, hey, Peter. You know, there's a much more better way to do this, right? Now, you don't need to do this three by three digging thing that you do with the little nub at the end there. There are more consistent, faster, and safer ways than what you're doing. Have you taken those into account yet? To answer your question, no, I haven't. Yes, man! Alright. Hey, you got some chests around here? No? Okay. All right, good joke. Uh, we got any gear? Any of that armor for uh, for a bud? I already got those. There we go. All right, all right. I'm not picky. I'll take what I I'll take what I can get. And I'll be quite happy with it. That's still a nasty amount of resources, though, man. Like, goddamn. Let's say we got everything. Let's say we got just about everything. 
Not a bad haul. Not a single trap chest ring, any of that, huh? Yeah, sure. True, very true. Alright. Which way were chat? Sorry, which way was I going? I think I was I need to go what? North to get back? What was the direction that I was headed? South of Song? Okay, so I said north. Thank you. Thanks for the TF answer. Three in a row? Uh, I have no idea what you're talking about. Not a clue what you are talking about. Hey, big man! Hey, big man! Hey! <laughs> I knew those zombies weren't coming from a place of natural spawns. Yeah. I'm just gonna get out of here real fast. Um, you know what I'm saying? Hey, buddy. What a cutie. I guess everybody's saying, wow, you're uh, kind of a little bitch tonight, huh? You don't want to know how much damage these guys deal with you. If it's anything like the elite skeleton that fought me with melee because he didn't properly spawn in with a bow, I may or may not have dropped down 14 out of 15 of my hearts in a single hit. So uh, I will be as conservative as I need to be to fight that boy. And that's just going to have to... That's a full key. Oh god. Wait, what the fuck is going on here? Oh, <laughs> there was no wall behind where I was shooting. <laughs> oh, some, uh, some trickery happened with a mob down there. Ooh, okay. Be cautious not to proc the spawner over there. No! Are we fine? We're good. Randomly punches with his water buckets while moving. Just a habit that I have. It became a thing while speedrunning where I would just start randomly clicking the air. And I think it's just because I like... Believers, here's the thing. You would do the same. Uh, no, actually I wouldn't. Um, if people were trusting me with uh, their channel points, I would do my absolute best and everything in my power to help the believers because they invested their hard work and time into this stream, and uh, that's the least I could do for them. So, uh, no streamer, I think you're just kind of a dickhead. How'd you fall on my head? Who nerfed me?
It's a good time to get fear. Hey, guys. See you later. That dude's spinning over there for. Not feeling myself with four and a half minutes left in the loot that I got. You know what I mean? The shield proc though? Oh, did it proc the shield when the dude hit me? <laughs> it's funny. Need the portal room? Should be, right? Yep. Alright. I'm gonna go check out another room real quick. Going south. Gotta go north one to get back home. Just gotta remember that small little tidbit of info. More X mark rooms and obelisks. Juicy end to the vault? Hmm. I do see the livings down there. You want to depart though. I'm, I'm good. The two X marks, one good, one bad. Everything evens out. Nobody can't say nothing to me. Cool, cool. All right. We got one piece of gear. It's a scrappy plus pair of leggings. What rarity is it going to be? All right. See what we got. Oh, the scrappies take it home. And the doubters on the completion and scrappies on the votes. The majority's getting it. Ooh. Now that's an improvement. Not by much to be honest, though, because we already have seven armor on these. Uh, eight armor. Okay. Uh, so, you know, we're getting the tier two armor values, which is nice, a seven armor. But it is only a scrappy, so we only get one prefix and one suffix, and that prefix comes with plus one armor. Um... I'm honestly down to reroll this a couple of times to try and see if we can pull like a mana thing or plus two armor on that. Some kind of mana regen plus mana, something along those lines, because I could use that. Oh my god. Oh yeah. It's 801 durability though. The one durability up <laughs> But an additional 10 mana in Soulbound. So you're going to be with us for quite a while. Okay, so I'm losing out on item quality and thorn chance. I don't care. 6% creator resistance is also max for tier 1. So pretty good. You're... I haven't had this vault. Well, I've had it once. I love this thing. It's not looking like a completable one in case, unless we get uh, super lucky. Oh, dude. Looks so nice, man. I haven't had the nether theme, and I've had the snow theme once, but yeah, I haven't had the nether theme yet. East facing vaults. Slow ember spawner. This a fella get. What the? Oh no, that you are extremely fast. Chill. The water color looks like it would taste like blue raspberry. I 
respect it. I respect it. Then you got a little bit of a sweet tooth there, boss. Next time we're at the grocery store, buy that bag of gummy bears. You deserve it. What is this POI? Cool. It's a cool, cool little POI spot. If all makes me pag, do you do that in public? Alright, who else thought that was the next mark? I swear I did. Seems not worth it just on the surface. How are you? Where are you coming from? There's something right behind this mound. What the? F what? <laughs> where are you spawning from? What the? F Fuck? That's not from that spawner? Alright, I gotta see what's going on back here, man. Hey! What? I- I don't understand the spawning- the spawner radius of his vault? What the fuck? I thought I insta broke that. What is happening? This vault, man. I just, I want to figure out, like, what am I, what am I looking at here? What am I dealing with? isn't working the way that I want it to exactly. It's a little better. There's no way I'm getting styled on, dude.
Oh, my... Ugh. Minus nine minutes to one room. <laughs> if Iskal ever wants to know, is it worth it for people to run a single room to get loot? Send that. That is study footage. <laughs> My god, man. And you know what? It didn't feel that bad, to be honest. Like, the loot was worth it. It wasn't a horrible investment. I just... God, that is so much time lost. Was the five next to my name mean? Uh, it's how many days do you have left? Cameron, hope you're doing well. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> It'd be like that sometimes, brother. It really do be like that. Oh my god. I'm about to feel alive. Free wheat before I get my auto farm set up. What's up, Brandon? Yo. Nice name. Doing fine. Yeah. Yeah, I bet you are. I'm fine, I guess. I, I was afraid that I placed that shulker toward me and it was just gonna knock me off. Oh, you can shift and do that. Cool. You're not gonna let me do that? There you go. Just saving that for later.
I got any potions, basically free apples. Uh, you're fucking right, aren't you? Yeah, you're actually really right. If I'm gonna be saving up for boss fighting, it's a pretty major thing. Wait, literally plus one in the third gapple. Good shout, good shout. I'm not upset at the backseating, it's just that you're right, and I have to backtrack further in a vault. Oh. In a vault where I've explored five rooms in total. Good rooms, though. Real. Very real. So not a player or? If you're talking about the one that was low down in the water, it was gold. Talking about the one that I mined, yeah, it was spark thing. Where's it going? It's going south, right? Which way was it to go home? Any tea uppers? No, the mornings, it's still pretty worth. It's still pretty worth. You can get some good stuff from there like I just did. Like, I don't know. The health pots are nice for stocking up on boss fighting. Yeah, like, you can get a lot of knowledge essence and, um... Okay. About to get dropped in two seconds. It's the knowledge essence that's really worth and, like, the burger pieces for experience. Wait, living chests are really nice. Oh, hey! How are you doing? Alright, chat. Oh, looks like you guys- Oh, looks like you guys have redeemed yourself since last time. You know? It's looking a little better. You will leave it. Down. Two of those. Ooh. Oh man, three of those? Damn. Well, yeah. What are you guys stuffing these with, man? This ain't an Easter bunny. It doesn't need to be filled. I'm about to lose my mind, man. That's just disrespectful.
Any opal? Any paint out? Are you filling the Easter Bunny? I'm hollowing it out. What you mean? Oh, brother. Ah. It is what it is, still it ain't. Such a good fucking lyric, man. I gotta find my way out is the thing now. I just want to know what direction I came from really quickly. Came from the north, okay. One more should be home. If not, it's south two directions. Thanks for the heads up and direction, chat. Appreciate it. Has anyone found the, um... Castle Omega Room with the, like, 30-something-odd gildeds since I found it that one time? A scale two times. A couple people? Oh, okay. It is beer? Okay, okay. I haven't caught anyone, um... I haven't caught anyone finding it. I was just curious. Do the boss! Okay, so it's, it's, yeah, it, it's definitely appearing. Okay. I was just curious, because I'm like, I've only found it once, and I haven't found a mine room, and I was just wondering if, like, that room and a mine room are, like, equal rarity of being, like, extremely fucking rare, but I've just apparently not caught any content where people have gotten it, which is a little upsetting, I'm not gonna lie. That was full of ornates. The, sorry, that's the one I'm talking about. All right. Decent vault. Decent loot, you know? <laughs> Happy birthday to me, the bare minimum for 18. Yippee! Try to craft a couple of good vault crystals. Yeah, we haven't really done that yet, huh? Yeah, you know what? Why don't we do that? Why don't we do that? Why don't we do that? Um, how many bedside do I have? Why am I searching there? 39 bedside gems and 11 bedside ore? Okay. And what is it again to infuse? It's just a perfect bedside. That's literally it. I should probably have a ton of catalyst fragments, right? Oh, yeah. Uh, let's see what we get here. We'll see what we get with these. I'll do a little bit of rolling, see maybe maybe build a nice crystal or something. 
I'm not gonna be too bad of a shout. Do six for now. I'll hold on to the rest of the bats just in case. Nine of those. Okay. Okay. What do you got for me? Oh, soul charge to operate. Huh. Interesting. So that's a farming one. That's actually pretty good for a farming one. Trap could also be nice because you're looking for mobs. There you go. So that's kind of a double positive, really. All right. Living and Furious, another one of those bad boys. Wealthy and Furious, okay. Preposterous. Oh! <laughs> really now? That's the new name for it. Interesting. Okay. Lucky and Injured. Minus health just straight off the bat? Interesting. I wonder if that's HP or if that's full hearts. I'd imagine that's HP, so you lose a heart. And the last one? Ornate and poisonous. Interesting. Okay. All right, all right, all right. We're holding off on this one for a while, I think. <laughs> so we've got three livings then. Living and two, two... One freezing and two furious. We have three wealthies. Freezing, wild, and furious. We have an extended, we have a haunted, we have an ornate. We have a preposterous and we have a lucky. Or prosperous, not preposterous. We need new boots. We need new boots incredibly. That's, that's an extremely important one. We need a new helmet. We need boots and a helmet. Let's run it up. We don't have any proficiency in it. Whatever. It's fine. That'll, we'll, we'll get that level up eventually, right? Yeah. Yeah. Run me, baby. So, you know what? Yeah, helmet. Let's do both, and let's do a Gamba. Soulbound's important. Soulbound is... Here's the thing, man. You get, like, basic good gear with Soulbound. Not only is that... When you when you die, you save so many resources not having to recraft. Soulbound, man, is... Oh, man, it's good. It's real good. Boots first. We already have three health on here, so it would be three and a half additional hearts in total. Um, Kind of bad. The four armors is pretty brutal, to be honest. I'll hold off for a second. I'll see the helmet. Anything? Oh my god. Okay. All right. Oh, man. It's two additional armor, right? That's tier two, five to six. It's in our Dura. Three health. Prefix is three health and ten mana. Six armor is not a bad thing at all when I'm only on three right now, you know what I mean? What about plus two armor on Soulbound, though? Six. 
sick. Four armor, four health. Four armor is very low. Two health, four health is really nice though. Do a little bit of regen for me. 23 armor, 30% defense. It's a lot more defense than before. Side of that, we run with boots again with another al another set of alloys. Uh, is this soulbound? No. I'm making new boots. We spending today, aren't we? What was the proficiency? 0. 0.8 and 1.9? Okay. It's a spendy kind of day today, is it right? Can we get better than that, please? Um, that brings us back. Oh man, but I lose my health though. Bro, look at my, what bonus HP? Oh my God. What bonus HP are you talking about, man? I don't know about that. <laughs> That's not worth the 10 mana and the soul bound. There's just no way it is. It's just not, it's not worth it. Fundamental focus maybe? No, not on a common. Not on a common. These are, these are rare. We've only gotten two in our entire time play, and they were from winning vaults. Completing vaults. I, I don't know why I'm rolling. I can't get armor and health. I can't get armor and health, and I need both. I don't know why I was rolling. I think I was rolling for health and soulbound. Hey, you know what thing about, um... What's the point in keeping stuff if you're not gonna spend it? The point was, what's the point in keeping anything if you're not gonna spend it? That was the point. <laughs> God, so bad. <laughs> we were, we low rolled like crazy on the proficiency. What the fuck?! I'm getting scammed. What, boots? Because I need boots! Oh my god, just give me the high armor. God bless. Get her on a bug! Do I not exist? Did I airball? You mean point one? I had one point eight before I did that, did I not? Are you in bag and lucky? I literally got nothing. It was 1.7? I love life. I'm gonna eat my own ass. Where's the guy I just banned for saying that I look like I like it up the bum? I might unban them, honestly. I might be onto something. Again? I don't have any the means to go again. I don't have anything else to go again. I'm spent. I am spent. Yeah, the gear is a little bit of a rough spot for us. But you know how we get more gear? We run vaults. Alright, cool. Let's go. It's 
It's a lot of commons. I know it's furious. What am I doing? It's a lot of commons, though. I'm gonna be cautious, but... That looks like a relatively doable scavenger. Hey, up there. A good one, but... Hi, every... Well, that's a nice start to a fault. <laughs> Hi, guys. Time one's never worth IMO. Altars just at the moment are not worth the time lost to looting the vault or displaying the objective. I think Black Mob Essence is complete. Nah, Black Mob Essence is only from skeletons and ghosts. So that'll be a little bit tricky to figure out. That might actually be the limiting factor. It'd be nice, and I'm surprised they didn't do this, but it would be nice if the icon to the left of um, the essence did show the mob that the essence was from. I figured that was the case because of how in detail they did with everything else, but... Found the ghost. Centerly got pinned. Hello, Gildeds. First time watching a stream? How you doing? Nice, thanks for the essence. Oh, hello. Off me, man. Thank you. Actually, this is uh, kind of nice that we're farming assistance like crazy right now. What? The oh, it was an ambush that whole time. here. We got an east-facing vault. My movement's so choppy right now, dude. Ah, oh, man, it's been so long in that. That's some damage. It's a new axe. Skeleton and coin piles. Not crack scripts, man. Not candles. Give me the vials. Yes. <gasps> yeah. All right. Vials are done. Huge. What's some fat? Ah, piles. Two ghosts? You don't take knockback, I gotta back up a little bit, or I'm gonna lose my crossbow durability in this vault. <laughs> yes, man. This is going well so far. What 
Where are you coming from? Red scroll! Oh, shit. Oh, you're slow. Nice. Hey, uh, we're kind of slamming out the, um... Oh, this is a gilded as well. Wait, I don't need any more gilded, though, but I do need the, uh... Oh, my God. I do need that ghost dead, though. Might have just been above the fuck. Axe damage is very good. Axe damage is really, really nice. So we need regular chests. We need another skeleton or ghost essence and rip pages. Thank you, shield. Holy fuck. So much damage. Pages are done. Regular chests are done. Yes. Still just one. Spawn more, spawn more. I'm staying here. Is that it? Oh my god. Oh my god. We just need an empty jar. We just an uncommon from an ornate and we're done. Yo, give me an X mark, man. Diamond vault. East facing, we're going south, so I need to go north to get back home. Please remember that. If y'all would be so kind. Points aren't worth it right now. I'm beelining for subjective. Gilded is not ornates. Living chests. It's 
fault Leo was actually made for this scav. It's crazy. It's time alter down there. I saw that. It looked like uh, a structure that could have ornate, so I was doing a little scan of it. the deep slate, whatever those darker blocks are that's kind of tripping me out, making me think it's ornate POIs. Oh! A drop-off! That's like pretty close to, uh, was it north to go back home, right? So that's basically south from spawn. That's pretty much south from spawn. Okay. Pretty much right at the wall as well, too. So south from... Try and keep a note of this. South from spawn... Um... Furthest west. I'm gonna go south again. You guys are so good at taking notes. Surely all of you guys have uh, 3.5 GPAs or higher with this kind of note taking. Like I got I got a chat full of scholars, obviously. There's another drop off point there. Coins? So many coin POIs. I know I'm not exploring entire rooms, but I'm at least catching a good half of the POIs in the room and then just going to the next one. I think that's ornate. That definitely looks like ornate. Gotta back off the spawner. Double jars for the culture. Yeah, I got boosts too. <laughs> Fuck me. If these are better than what I crafted, man, I'm not going to regret it at all. It's just going to be funny.
Uh, time alter, I thought it was a drop off. Did I turn? Did I go the wrong way? Wait, what? I'm not. Am I literally not backtracking right now? I swear to God, I have been. Oh my God, I've completely backtracked. What the fuck? <laughs> it's further down this way. Hello. Go, oh, man. I'm losing my PR. Ow. <laughs> nice. I missed the room by one. I should have just gone straight from the room that I was in. It would have been literally there. Isn't it here? Yeah, it is. They don't get killed when you're literally at the zone, yeah? Oh my fuck. Lo loses the entire scab to one skeleton. Rat! Let's go, baby! That was like everything lined up, man. Literally everything. And the vault itself with all the ghosts and skeletons? The ghosts especially? That was a run-up right there, baby. 6800, though. Not bad for a Furious Vault, right? Pretty good, man. Pretty good. <laughs> Literally like the first room netted four of the five or like three of the five. That's crazy. All right. First of all, I got to do this before we do anything. Hold on one sec. Where, where are you? I got to roll you first. I got to see what you have to offer me. 18 chests complete. I mean, the item rarity, I gotta at least see what it is, right? <laughs> Was that five armor? Yeah, so those aren't very good. Okay. They're not bad, but we'll chuck them away. All right, scav crate, level 18, what you got for me? Two helmets, common plus, and a scrappy. An emote of clarity reveals all curses. Two vault diamonds. Emote of purity, another one of these, super nice. 27 driftwood. Not gonna complain about that, I'll probably need it. And a bitter lemon. Why so wait three hearts and add 30 seconds to the vault timer? Merry Christmas colors. If we ever needed it, I guess we have it now. I don't think I'm gonna bring it with me until we start getting into like time sensitive vaults to be honest. Well, I mean, I don't know. With the frequency and the likelihood of death inside of vaults, I'm scared to bring this with me. Cause I don't feel like my vaults have been a threat of time. It's been more of a threat of damage. So I don't know. Well. We got some gear to roll. Just play first. Scrappy boy. Is that a mirror of what I have currently? Six armor, less crit hit resistance, just has item rarity instead of soulbound and thorns. That's funny. All right, so not very great. Complex.
Dark Rhino Helmet. Ooh. It's my- it's the same thing. <laughs> it's the same helmet, but with an extra prefix. Health, maybe? Ugh, oh, man. So, we've actually gotten two pieces of armor that are better than what we're wearing, because they're equal in armor value, it just gives me plus 27% item rarity. So it's like, who cares about Soulbound, but you get a little bit more loot until you eventually die, and then you go back to this. <laughs> but in the meantime, though... What's the result of the Gamba? It stays common. The rolls have not been hitting tonight. Why is there a Hollywood advertisement on my Vault Helmet statistics? <laughs> why- why does it look like I'm about to walk into a theater during the 70s? <laughs> Who's playing tonight? Jesus, hello, legendary tier 4 8 to 9 roll. God damn. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, max roll on tier two, max roll durability, max roll on near literally the entire thing is nearly max rolled. Almost everything is maxed out except the one mana <laughs> and 21 durability off. Oh my god, losing this is gonna hurt. <laughs> Losing this is going to hurt so badly. <laughs> oh my god. So the armor value stays the same, but we got four and a half extra hearts. The unfortunate thing is that we can't re-roll it because, you know, we lose the legendary value. I wish it had Soulbound, but if it had Soulbound, that's a gimme, right? Like, that's the new helmet. But in the very least, that is still incredible. Shortest live helmet I've ever worn. 12 durability. Good one. God, man. My client's lagging. <laughs> what mods have you unlocked? Um, one just now. Submarine of time. Fair warning, I will... I hold all privilege to take it away from you in the next 37 minutes. <clears throat> and if you take it personally, then that's a skill issue. How do you not take damage during that entire thing? Are you cheating? What's going on over here? Whoa, whoa. What are y'all doing all the way over here? Oh? Damn. That was just dominance from the beginning. Good lord. Alright. Go. Yeah, I don't know, man. All right, let's try. Uh, let's try the whole vaulting thing again, maybe. I'll take it. Oh, oh. Um. South? Facing vault? Please?
God damn, the speed that you have on you. South facing vault, please? <laughs> Interesting. Oh my god, and skeletons do spawn here. Fantastic. Hello, friends. Uh, this might be the fastest fucking vault that I've ran in my life. What the hell did I just do? Surely I get this before the horde. We're good. Ow! Jesus Christ, there's no spawner right there, man. This should take care of all the essence that I need, though, as long as I'm cautious. Hey, bud, how are there so many of you? What the hell? There's so many mobs around me. I need to get down to the chest. Back off, man. I'm trying to speed run. Jesus. Okay, you know what, dude? Like, all right, man. You know, like, uh, whatever, man. I'm gone. Uh, you know what? I'll deal with. Uh, fuck. Mind you, it actually might not be like the fastest speed run ever because I need to get two Omega items from the, uh, <laughs> from the, yeah. But it it should be more doable in this vault than any other one I could have rolled. So at least I have that going for myself. Hello, literally everything. Yeah, I didn't notice the cracked pearl originally when I was freaking out about the amount of things required. But now that I see that, I understand the balancing of this a little bit more. Would fortune work on coin piles? No. There's no external thing that can modify the... That's one. What exactly were you going for there, bud? Nothing in there? No. I need to be checking for uh, drop-off points. Square vault makes, uh, things nice. Ouch. Out of spawner range. And into this spawner range. This isn't gonna be the cleanest, uh, POI clearing I've ever had in my life, but here we are. I'm the clown today. Well, I didn't know I still take four hearts from a baby zombie. Wouldn't want to run a vault if that wasn't the case. Where's your health bar? Did you take no damage? What the fuck? Yo, alpha child? What the fuck is that? You're probably gonna spawn, but in the rare case that you won't. Unlikely case that you don't do that. Am I really?
All right. Actually, fairly unlucky. Oh. I kind of want that. I'm trying to speed around, but I also kind of want that, you know? Christ, the damage that you deal to me. Ammo spawner? Ammo spawner. Man! I'm not talking to you. I'm not talking to you. All right, so south facing vault, and I'm going. Uh, I'm going east. Going east, gotta go west to get back home. But uh, I don't know if I'm going back home. I shouldn't be at the very least. Alter, what kind? Experience alter. Ornate chests. I saw like a lamp up there and I swear I thought it was echo or from the color that I oh there we go nice fault Just kind of worked out really well now, didn't it? <laughs> nice. <laughs> 10 minute, 20 second vault. All right. Okay. 29 chests, seven trapped. We broke how many coin piles? 56 coin piles. All right. Yeah, that was, um, <laughs> Two Omega items from, uh, coin spots. 
wealthy vault, by the way. Just kind of works out that way. We're getting close to the patch. Glad I was able to finish that in time. <laughs> Looking forward to seeing what it is. I'm excited based on uh, the little bit that we've talked in. How long it's been? I say how long it's been, but like you guys cook up so much stuff in such short time that I'm trying to say like, you know, a few days. I don't know. I'm excited. I'm, I'm, I'm stoked for it. Hey, what you got for me? Some leggings. Another bitter lemon. Uh, the legs that I've got are honestly pretty good. You know, to be fair. Amplifying focus. Another mode of clarity. You know, it's all right. It's not bad. Not bad. It's not great, but you know what? It's okay. I'll take the lemon. It's an extra minute if we need. What's the leg got in store for me today? Little scrappy boy. Five armor, four health. That's a tier two prefix. Five armor. Yeah, I want to stay in. Well, hmm. We're going to restart now then? All right, sounds good. Let me get this in first. Ooh. Good with me. All right. Uh, the Vault Additions added some new, larger point of interest. Sick already doing this literally in Alpha. Uh, added the first scaling loot tables around level 10. Interesting. Um, you can now downgrade the level on a Vault Crystal by combining it with a diamond in the Anvil. Every diamond lowers the Vault level in the Crystal by 1. This affects everything, including loot tables. Interesting. Okay, so that's good if like higher level players that have a lot of crystals want to run a co-op with like lower level people. Hmm. Or just like other stuff maybe. Interesting. Uh, wrote a new mod, Entercell, a charging station that is now shipped with the building gadgets unlock. It can be used to charge any gadget. Oh, interesting. That's cool. Okay, so building gadgets got a little bit of a buff then. Added four unique sword models and two more unique axe models. Very sick. Added the ping mod. Allows you to keybind pinging a block suggested by Barry. This mod may not stay, but we can test it out. Is that so? I'm slouched. Leave me alone. Hold on a second. Uh, let me do something that I haven't done in a minute. With Windows. So I can quickly get to and fro from this. Controls, keybinds, ping. Open ping menu. Alert, go to, look, and mine. What do I currently have that set as? I'll go in game, wait. Okay, it's kind of. It's like Apex Legends! Wait, that's dope. Is there sound that I'm missing? Oh my god. Wait, that's fucking awesome. You can't alert when you're not looking towards a block. That's a distance away. What the fuck? You can't go that far, but that's kind of out of, like, vault distance anyway. What is the distance of it, though? Can I go do that tree? That's the bamboo. Jeez. Is the Vault Hunter's mod edition? I didn't catch it, though. I'll check the patches again. That's fucking awesome, man. How far is the range for other players? I have no idea. I want to test the range, though. Hold on a second. Can I ping that? That's pretty far. Oh, it shows on the, uh... Wait. I saw a thing on my, on my thing. Where'd it go? It was there for a second. Well, I saw, like, a red thing. Did that... Was that not something... I swear I'm tripping out right now. I swear, like, I saw a ping or, like, something that appeared, like, on the top of my screen.
Maybe not? Huh. Okay. So I can see if someone else pings, if so, that'd be awesome? Well, yeah, that's the point of a ping thing. I'd, I Otherwise, I'd feel like it would be quite redundant. I don't know what you would need to, like, signal to yourself, maybe, if you're trying to tell chat, like, hey, look at that grass block over there. That's sick. Okay. There was a ping? You did? Need, needs to be near? Uh... Oh, I see. It's black or transparent when you're looking at it, you're near looking at it, but when it's kind of out of range of your view. Wait, no. Why? Why is it turning a red when I look over there? But then anyway, else. Interesting. That's funky. Well, I'll play around with that in a little bit. Let's read the rest. What else we got? Okay, so out of the ping mod. Allows you to keep on a ping block. Very, very cool. Okay, changes and balance updates. Further buff some rare POIs in common rooms. Wow, further buffed. Okay, sick. Uh, change the base or ability scaling on weapons to start higher. Nice. God bless. Thank you. Made vaults scale in size at level 10 and further at higher levels. Undisclosed. Okay. Uh, Painite and Unique Gems now have a higher probability to appear in vaults level 11 or higher. Sick. Very, very cool. Uh, vault experience is now based on the offset of the vault level you are running. If you are 4 levels above the vault level you are running, you get an XP penalty. If you are 14 levels above that vault you are running, you get zero experience. So this is what we were talking about, or what I had brought up toward the beginning of my stream that we had pitched, and now here it is in writing. Um, this is kind of off of the feedback that I gave when I ran co-ops with Zine and Kara the other day, where I was like level 15 and they were level 4 and 2. And I wound up completing three of the, the three co-ops that we ran, and I got 19k experience as a result from it. And it's like, for one, I'm running scavengers that are easier because the mobs deal less damage so I can kill them faster and navigate rooms faster and also I killed the boss like or I was able to deal a lot of damage to the boss whereas when we tackled the boss earlier by ourselves you could see the difference was pretty extreme so yeah this means now that if you are much higher level then you don't get experience but if you're just a little bit higher level then you'll get a relative amount it's good but also if again if you guys weren't here the greater point of it not just like it being unfair is that this way if you run a bunch of co-ops as a higher level with lower level people, then you won't over level yourself when you're not getting proper gear. So like I went up two levels during those three co-ops from 15 to 17 and any gear drops that I got from the crates were all like level four plus. So they were all going to be low tier ones. They weren't going to be that great. So I was like boosting my own vault level, but I wasn't really getting a lot in return for myself. And if I had continued doing that, then I could have just dropped into like a level 20 vault and had the same gear pretty much. Not really had an opportunity to make others. Sure, I had some loot that I could get and craft, but generally this will avoid that like over leveling of yourself and kind of screwing you over, which is nice. Uh, skewed some more loot tables to further incentivize gear crafting. We are monitoring the loot closely and hope it doesn't fill the server with too many items. Okay, very cool. God altars now scale with your level and requirements. Oh, okay. So it's not just going to be static anymore. I was wondering when they were planning on changing that. Working through the week puts me behind on the VODs, but hey, at least I have a lot of content for the entire weekend. Lol, hope you're well, Pete. Waffle love. Yo, Divi, thank you very much for the thousand bits. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you so much. Hope the, uh, the work's gone well for you. Happy to be able to provide some VODs for you. Thanks for the thousand. Smoky Eyes, thank you very much for the 7 months. And uh, Luke and Swolf, thank you very much for the Tier 1. And Angry Griff Stoner, thank you very much for the Tier 1. Appreciate you guys a lot. Thank you so much. Uh, the Wild Modifier was completely reworked. It now spawns a set of mobs per room instead of constantly spawning mobs around the player. This makes the player able to win and clear a room. That is so nice. I'm glad they did this. Because, you know, with the way that it was before... Yeah, it kind of gave, like, a different feeling, because I think Iskal always liked the idea that you could, once you've cleared out a POI and weren't running anything at the moment, you could just AFK and not have mobs just constantly coming after you. 
So that's a really significant change. Very cool. Change bail to survive to teach gamers that bailing is not a negative, but seen as a positive. I can hear the Swedish undertones of this patch, of this patch note. Uh, change the sound when an ammo spawner burns out to alert the player better, hopefully. Very cool. Fixes. Fix runes having the wrong weight in altar chest, causing them to have a 99% chance of appearing. Please be a gamer and throw away any rune you have found this far. Fix an error with runes generating crystal cave as the room with a 99% certainty. So the one, so the one, uh, village room that I got, or the wild west room that I got was a 1% chance? God damn, I won the lottery. Fix room coloring on runes. Cool. Fix poison not affecting spiders and undead monsters inside of the vault. Very pog. Uh, fix vault axes and swords being usable as breaking tools. So axes can no large chop wood, so it's gonna break. Man. Man, whatever, dude. All right, fine. Uh, fix vault gear applying vanilla attributes such as armor and health, even when the player's level was below the vault level's gear. Uh, vault gear's level. This just meant that, like, if you were a higher level or a lower level than the Valkyrie that you had on, you were still getting protection from it. Just a bug fix or whatever. But, um... Cool. So, major changes. New mod. You can downgrade crystals. Scales off level for co-oping. New POIs. Scaling loot tables. Um, altars are now scaling with levels as well, too. Wild's better. This feels better. Vault size scaling is also pretty huge. They're building on what everything in here is really good. Like everything in here is very, just very, very good. Um, right. W patch. You're level 18 vault. Oh my god. Oh my god. We're both wealthy today. Hold on, it's y'all. I appreciate your streams. You're kind of lagging me a little bit, though. Alright, north facing vault. New better POIs? Oh, yeah, I should probably be actually like looting vaults properly with the new POIs, and probably would not be a bad idea. Oh, was that sizzle from the, uh. Oh. Oh. So those are more common now in level 10 plus vaults. That's nice. So that sizzle is the extinguish. Yeah, I think that'll do a pretty good job of convincing people. Giving their attention. Okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> so about those loot tables. <laughs> Guys, it was a small sample size. It it's everything's fine. Nothing else here, nothing else there. Oh, that's such a cool sound. Fair, fair. I stuffed all the loot into one chest. Guys, relax. Guys, you are being way too reactionary. Wink, wink. <laughs> Shut up. Guys, I'm just lucky, okay? Like, this is clearly everything is fine.
Oh my god, I'm finally getting more than one diamond out of a chest now. Yeah, drop down, bud. Find out what happens. You dodged that? Guys, it's fine. I'm just getting more gilded chests than I normally do, but that happens sometimes. It's a wealthy vault. That was a distance. Holy shit. How did that proc? They did say they want to encourage gear building? They did. And apparently skill point crafting? <laughs> See an altar up there. What kind? I'll do whatever altar it is, even if it's a time altar. Just to try out and see if there's any change in scaling. Experience. I'm probably not going to be able to do it. Damn. Nope. <laughs> not going to be able to do that. Oh, hello. Guys, surely ornate chests aren't going to be buffed either. That should seem fine. Damn. I want to find an altar. A dead end? Yeah, this entire room's a dead end. Alright, so north facing vault and we're heading east. Gotta go west to get home. Hey man, my cooldown. Oh, well, something went down, didn't it? Okay, all right. I see your game. That's some good scaling right there. From where exactly, might I ask? Oh, how, how did how did how did I dodge that guy? Hey guys, well, this is an interesting POI. Um, you guys trapped in there? Y'all need any help getting out? Psych, bitch. That's the wrong number. So this POI is new, unless I've somehow never found it before. Gildas are pretty, they're pretty in right now. Gildas are pretty, they're, they're kind of all that. Oh. 
Oh, with the new frequency in pay night spawns and such and gems. I'm interested. I'm interested. Holy fucking shit. <laughs> Find me an area that I can kite around without procking other spawners, please. This vault really is. They test everything vault. I see an Ashton up there. Surely you guys can't reach me from that. So many spiders. Stay down. Stay down. Nice missing both. <laughs> Done yet? I'm seeing a lot of... I'm seeing a lot in front of me right now, and I'm just gonna hold my tongue until I'm out of this room. Yeah, I'm seeing a good few things here. I always overcharge my crossbows. I can shoot a lot faster than I give him credit for. Stop asking people to type one or two in chat. Type one above you if the chat or in front of you, stupid. What did I just say? Bro, can you... I can't talk, man. I'm overwhelmed. Type one of the streamer sucks. Fuck you. Banning everybody. Ow. <laughs> Says ow, takes no damage. I still remember when I was in fourth grade. I was in science class and I, uh, well, no. It was like a science period. And I had asked, all right, I had this question. It was just random or whatever. We we're talking about like human reflexes and stuff like that. And 
I raised my hand and asked the teacher a question, and I said, how come when we get hurt is our first reaction to say, ow? And the teacher looked at me like I was a fucking moron. And everybody else in the class was like, well, c yeah, because you got hurt. Like, what else would you say? And I felt like the dumbest fucking person that existed in that period of time. My teacher was like, yeah, you idiot. Yeah, my teacher didn't actually say that, but my teacher was like, what are you asking? And I'm like, I don't know. Like, why do we say ow when we get hurt? Why is that a reflex? And no one entertained that idea at all. And I just went about my day feeling stupid. Like, why would I even ask that question? And I still don't know the fucking answer. Why when we get hurt do we exclaim through vocals in that kind of way? Like, it was a good fucking question. I was just a fourth grader that didn't have a backbone. It was like, oh, teacher doesn't think teacher thinks it's a dumb question? It must be a dumb question. Like, why do why do we speak when we're hurt? Or when something inflicts pain? Why is our reaction to scream or to like fucking I don't know, talk to me, man. Maybe I just needed to hear Maybe I just needed somebody that day, you know? Maybe I was just having a bad day and wanted to hear from a teacher. Whatever, man. I get it. Probably asking for help or something like that? Well, that was kind of my understanding of it, was like, without any scientific knowledge, just like an assumption of like, we're social creatures, and re not, we don't rely on other people for help, but we kind of do to some degree, right? That's me! This patch is perfect. So it's like, you know, I figured, oh, like, okay, so we speak that, those words, and, like, we exclaim when we're hurt because we're trying to get the help of other people around us. Like, it's usually a cry for assistance to some degree. But no, man, apparently it's a dumb fucking question, man. Natural reflex from childhood to make a noise to alert their parents. And his side transform around into a socially acceptable and well-known sound, thus ow. Any hours in chat? Seven TV proving once again that emotes that replace a perfectly used and said all lowercase word are a double-edged sword. Hey, man. Bro, I need an anvil. Just fucking kill 12 of them in one swing. Ink. Hulk. Yeah, something like that. Bro. I think the dude just got circumcised. Ah. Ah. Far, I got three shot by a husk two vaults later. Hey, AMA.
There are other orbs in this vault, I know. But where are they, though? Are there actually, or are we done? Are there no more ores in this vault? In this room? There's an underground area. I want to go check the underground real quick. Is that what direction I got to go to get out? Any tea uppers? You know, for a single air mar, there's an in there. The brick actually just saved my life. Risking it all, dude. I'm about to risk it all. I'm gonna click send. Time five minutes, bitch. I know what time. I know what time. Thing. All right. This always stuck in the crystal. Yeah, I know. I think there were some spiders in it too. This guy survived! Such a good change. Oh my god, I'm going to as well! Yeah, baby! Whoa. <laughs> Look at that. Oh! Did you find a mine room? Uh, so that's a good reaction to it. No, this is one crystal room. Hmm, okay. I did see that Mookie pushed something this morning about the crystal room, but I didn't look at what he did. Let me have a look. Let's see. Three of these is. Escalium ores were all connected to each other, by the way. I thought that was pretty sick. Let's, do Let's this run one. it up. Be After you. percent Peters in my chat, by the way. I'm gonna work really hard. Chunky Mo- Oh! Corpse Gav. Corpse Gav is good, it's fun. What do you have for your items? I'll write mine down in chat. I have- okay, should I do that too? I mean, I prefer writing all the shopping lists just so we have our ideals. Um... The earring is my hardest one. It's from a gilded, it's an Omega gilded. Oh boy. Oh, yours are zombie significantly hide. tougher than mine, yeah. We both have zombie hides. Four for me. How many do you have? Oh, six. Okay, so we need ten. I'm gonna go... That should be fine. Should be fine. I'm gonna go east side of the vault. East side? Okay, I'll go... I'll go... I'll go north. I'll go north. Okay. Dude, I love the co-op scav, though. Oh, it's so great. Oh. 
Yeah, I don't know if you got around to rewatching it, but I did a co-op scab the other day with Zen and or uh, yeah, Zen and Kara, and it came down to the wire. We nearly had every single item for all three of us, mm. um, but we were sh shy. Just one item for Zen, but Kara and I had everything. And I found a drop-off point with like four minutes left, and Kara was on the complete other side of the vault, and I had to like be like. It's all the way south, two rooms west, and they were like, I found a, uh, a trading area, like, is this where you were? And I'm like, and it came down to, like, 15 seconds left, uh, Car and I both got out of there, and Zine just managed to bail the vault entirely. Oh, nice. Oh, I was nuts. <laughs> a nail biter. No, I haven't seen it yet. I, like, when you stream every day, I'm, I'm trying to catch up best I can. And then it's like, you know what I have a problem with? It's like mm. I wake up, I'm like, oh, okay, it's Pete, it's Pete time while I while I eat my breakfast and stuff. <laughs> uh, but then it's like, oh no, Pete is live. Do I not want to watch live? But then I spoil myself, and it's like, <laughs> oh, so you didn't catch up on the vod? Um, so I watch a vod, but then if I see you live, I usually want to switch over to the live version. Right. Yeah. Uh, usually, one. but yeah, it's difficult. It's difficult. We stream too much, Pete. That's I know, the man. There's not enough time in the day. You went live, and I, I I pulled up your stream on my computer just so I could watch while I was live. I'm like, I want to see him read out the patch notes. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I'm going to go back in your vote and, and watch your patch notes. Okay. If you did them on stream. I did, I yeah, I did. Yeah. It's it's my learning, my learning curve, what works and what doesn't work. The spots in the in the rooms that have like a little tunnel that ends abruptly is that a spot where a dungeon could have been but didn't yeah generate yep. okay yeah uh there are four dungeon spots in every room and of course uh, there are 37 different common rooms so <laughs> they're not the same all of them hmm. um but that specific room i think was the first dungeons we added and it looks a little bit weirder than that so that's a hint for where they can be uh, you can also get unlucky and get a, a non-dungeon to spawn in in that spot. Uh, but then it's always an epic PY. It's always like a little bit better. Oh, interesting. Okay. Uh, but yesterday, or when I streamed last on, on Thursday, I found... Oh, I found the big ornate dungeon. It was such a good feel. Was that the... Uh, oh, dungeon. Okay, okay. Yeah. I think I've... Was that the one with the lava? Um, no, no, one? this one is bigger. This one is bigger. This one has like two layers, two spawners. Very cool. Oh my god, yeah, I haven't seen that one. I'm not doing too well on the scavs. I don't think I found a single thing except the green mob essence. I found one zombie hide so far. Yep. Oh, I got cracked script. Did you need that? I, need I don't. Open in chat, but... No, okay. Also, the new sound for extinguishing the ambush spawners is very good, yeah. Oh, dude. Somebody's hit hard! Holy! I'm glad you like it. That was a berry suggestion that I hadn't even thought about, and then, yeah. I sat there yesterday, right when we were finishing everything up, and I was like, yeah. Should we just, um... Should we just add this sound and then I added it? Maybe we'll add a sound. It's a cherry on top. Well, Pete, I found a village room. Okay. And living chests are specialized. God dang it, I don't have any. Oh, no, I do. I do, I do, I do. V village rooms, uh, I mean, living chests are specialized on knowledge. This I've could heard. be big. So I've heard. Oh, I don't think I got a portal, though. No, it's gotta this be it. Though. I've died every time I've gone down here. Really? Yeah. But but that was because Silverfish was, like, not balanced. That oh, are they balanced now? now? Uh, well, the Silverfish themselves were balanced, but the amount of Silverfish was not. Oh, okay. Yeah, I usually but try I and just a lot of mobs. break into the portal room and kind of keep myself elevated so I don't ever fight a Silverfish. Right. Oh, dude, I'm dying. I'm gonna die. Oh, I'm alive. You're good. 
Whoa, what the heck was that spider, man? <laughs> it's not a beginner's graceful. You almost made me get over your ghost. Right, we have the ghost mechanic. Woo. Jeez, dude, I'm I'm not geared for level 13 vault apparently. <laughs> it's the chunky as well. It's the chunky man. They take that extra hit to kill. I can't really go into this room. Hmm. Is there a portal room in there that you're working on? No, no, there's no portal room. There's a oh. library that I want to get into. Oh, I haven't tried any of the other rooms. If there's no portal room, I usually dip out because, like, I've always been scared of that concentration of mobs. Like, those yeah, tight little corners so that you can't escape from. And there are challenge mobs as well, so they are... They're scary boys. Why am I not getting that? So I fight for one living chest and there's no knowledge and it feels bad now. The Thank zombie has not appearing. Poison cloud working on mobs now feels amazing, by the way. I haven't had a weapon that a poison cloud during the duration of it working. I think it may be become meta. It's really strong. I was way, assuming like, then... Balanced. I was assuming then that the, uh... What was it? Nova poison probably didn't work on those mobs either before this fix? It did. It does. It does. It's not actually poison. It's our own thing. Oh, okay. Cool. So Nova works, yeah. No one's gone into that, I don't think. Requires a few levels in it. Dude, I'm just so scared at the moment. You're in a dangerous area, but you know it better than anybody. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I should know it better than anybody. But I should. Yeah. I'm I'm dipping. I'm dipping this room. It's 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 scary. <laughs> what does the library have in there? Uh, just more more of the living chest, like. The way we've done it is every challenge room and every Omega room should have their own purpose. Um, and the the village room is like living chest purpose. So it's the best source of living stuff. And then like the Wild West room is really good for guilds and stuff. Yeah. I like yeah, exactly. that. It's so that you can learn where to loot and what to loot. Yeah, that's cool. You have a um, weird question here, but it makes yep. sense. Did you have this uh, theme on your last wall too? Um, I think so. Okay, because I did too, and I may there may be a config thing that the build team forgot to switch back. I'll check it after this run. I'll check it after this run. The player join lag. So, you needed a bottle, did you? I need a blood vial, empty jar, and hide. I have an empty jar for you. Oh, sick, okay. Um, Still trying to work on the hide and the blood vials. Though. Yeah, I don't have a single blood vial. I've been I've been very ineffective, this vault. Oh, apparently the one that I had before this was the uh, amethyst. Oh yeah, it was, yeah it was. Oh, okay, okay. Cool. And it's just the RNG. Trap. Have you uh you haven't gone frost nova, right? I haven't, no. It's my favorite ability. What do you like uh, so much about it? Everything. This is the mobs, <laughs> the way the way it looks, the way it sounds. Oh. I have seen you use it. I do like the visuals. Yeah, I, I I think it's great. It was one of the first abilities that I designed back in like July. Oh, wow, okay. Like, oh, it's going to be so fog. All oh, right, the vaults are bigger now as well. Huge. 
Do you need anything for more niches? Nope. I need that eerie. I I don't think I can complete it unless we find like a mega gilded dungeon or something. But earrings super rare. That's from gilded. I got rolled. Yeah. I got rolled. It's fine. I had, I haven't even found a single zombie hide yet, and you need them too. I've got. I think I found two out of ten that we need in total. Yeah. We'll try and complete one of us if we can. Sharing is caring. Ah, uh, it's both or we're dead. Hmm? We gotta get both. No man left behind. <laughs> no, that's stupid. Then no one wins. <laughs> I was trying to, I was trying to be oh. emotional, let's go. Oh? Oh! Shield! Coming in clutch. What the heck? Why is he doing? What is, what is the damage? Wait, 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 Pete, chill. Chill, 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 chill. Chilling, what chilling. is the damage that just happened to me? <laughs> Bro! Stop! What is going on? I've never been this scared in a vault. <laughs> what did I just do? So that armor, uh, a little paper, huh? Uh, I don't know. I don't know, bro. I don't know. I'm feeling, I'm feeling threatened. That was a ghost, I think. Did six hearts of damage. They can't crit. Ghosts are with. gnarly. Yeah. Because I didn't see him either. They, they come and they sneak up on you, don't they? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. I, I, I don't know what happened. I just got absolutely overwhelmed. Oh, and that's coin piles. Yeah, dude. The ghost is dealing like six damage per hit. Hmm. Interesting. I still think the scariest mob in the entire vault is a skeleton with a bow. Oh, for sure. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh. Oh, they. they oh, yeah. They're, they're horrible. <laughs> but that's what I mean. Like, skeleton with a bow, I expect to be like one. Um. This I didn't expect them uh, it to be run. Where are my blood vials though? I put, I put the blood vial up there. I have one blood vial now. How many oh, that's do you okay. need? I need two of them. I need two too, so I need one more. Oh, you know what I did? I think mm. I activated three PUIs at once there. I didn't look properly. Yeah. That was fun. We were dealing with one group of mobs and then five others coming from around the corner. Yep. 11 minutes. I survived, though. I saw you've been using a crossbow now as well. Oh, crossbows have been... Yeah, they've been saving my life. They're huge. It is getting to a point, though, where the damage is... Falling off a considerable bit. Chunky mobs. Yeah, they, like it takes time, right? You're investing time to shoot the mobs. Yeah. That's what I was thinking, like, if the range situation on here doesn't change, like, too much in terms of, like, new weaponry or whatever, um, I feel like people will eventually go back to, uh, punch two bows at some point just to, like, have an option to get the distance on a mob that's running up on you, even if it's sacrificing, yeah. like, the ability to hit more than one. I got some gilded's down here. True, 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 true. Uh oh. How many earrings did you need? Just one. one. I just found a gilded dungeon, but I can't get the spawner. It's upstairs. I think it's a small dungeon, though. So there are different sized dungeons, I should say. Did you need anything from gilded? Like scroll or anything? I don't know. Can't get up there to kill the spawner. I got a key piece from a gilded. It's not an earring. You got a key piece? That's rarer than an earring, though. Nice. I'd rather take the earring in this case, though. <laughs> have you found a key piece yet? Yeah, I found a. I think I have five in total. Oh, dude, you can go uh, treasure room. Well, maybe with the black opal that I've gotten from the increased spawns now, I possibly could. 
before it was the Black Goblin that was limited me considerably. Oh, I also forgot to put this in bug reports before the patch went out. Um, but me and Zine's cluster are the only ones that have a recipe at the moment. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, it's meant to be eight gems and a perfect Black Opal in the middle, right, for a cluster? Mm-hmm. Yeah. We're the only ones that are craftable at the moment. I mean, like, you know, I get it. We're the new gems, you know, I like, should only be us, right? That's a weird, a weird oversight. Okay, we will, we will have to fix that. That's a quick thing to fix, though. Well, I got a, I got a gilded dungeon, but not a single, uh, not a single one of the boys I needed. Sag. Still working on the zombie hide. Uh, yeah, I haven't got a single one. I'm not really too fast about completing it. I'll give you what I have found. Yeah, I don't know how possible it's going to be. I feel like this room that I'm in might be one of my last shots. I'm looking at some guilds for you, and I've got a coin pile over here. I'll say experience. Yeah, I feel like Poison Cloud is super cool now that it works on mobs. I'll have to get a weapon to try it out. Dude, I feel so slow in this vault. Like, I feel... Have you ever got that when you, like, if you die in a vault? Uh, and then you get, like... I suppose it's like a confidence thing. Right now, my confidence almost dying there is so much lower than it normally is. And I'm like taking my time with, with things that I wouldn't normally take my mm -hmm. time with. Now I'm a bit shaky, man. I, I love the fact that the game actually does that to a gamer. It's nice, yeah. I think you guys do a really good job of making it to where every mob feels like an individual challenge. Right, Especially. this is much better than what we did, because I know this has been a thing that people have been a bit scared about. But remember, everyone should remember, we are playing on hard difficulty. Mm -hmm. The game ships with normal and easy as well. And impossible for the uh, experts. Oh? But the, I, I think that the game... I like the fact that PvE actually feels fun now. It feels fun with abilities and every mob is a challenge. I got a red scroll from a gilded. Uh, we might have to start finding our way back if you don't know where a POI is. Oh, crap. We need one of those as well. We are doing a change to that in uh, an upcoming patch. It's a little bit of a big boy overhaul we need to do for it. But Interesting. it's going to make it so that the objective POIs are more common for scavs. Oh, okay. Bosses. But it requires a little bit of a rewrite, so it's... Yeah. But that is on the agenda. Well, if we can find a POI and meet up, I have everything for myself. Uh, I've got some green essence as well, but yeah, I don't know about the rings, the earrings. Oh, you have everything you need? I do, yeah. Except for, uh, you have the one blood vial that I would need to complete. Cool, cool, cool. I'm gonna make my way back now. Chad, any tea uppers? How do I get back? back in what direction? Room? Yeah, I think so, because I don't know where POI is, so I figure we can go to there and, like, maybe try and look for one nearby. Yep, I just got another blood vial. Um, yeah, let me just loot this one second. Yeah, yeah. I can't even guarantee that I'll be able to find a POI on the way back, but I admittedly wasn't Dude, looking in rooms using Hunter like I should have been. Oh, have you gotten the specialization for... Yeah, I did. Yeah, I think that's very smart. I think that's very smart for scavs. I saw some living there, but I'm just gonna dip. Hope I know where I am. Hope I know where I am. <clears throat> Hmm. 
Yeah, that was another discussion that I then tested out when people were like, it's too hard to find the things. I agree that scav should be a little bit more common. But uh, no one at that point had gone the hunter ability. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, I think I Abe just... went it first, and I really liked how it looked. Yeah, it's great. It's great. Because oh, I originally was, was turned off from it because of the... It was a 0.5 second thing, and I'm like, that's such a small window of time to see it. But then I didn't realize that, like, the fade out of the particles lasted for another couple of seconds afterward. And I'm like, oh, yeah, that's actually yeah. really nice then. It's like a blink thing. Um, but of course, the more you level it up, like, I think it ends with, like, having it active for, like, 12 seconds or something. Oh, wow. That's huge. So I'm in the first room east of, uh, of spawn right now. Um, okay. I needed to run back to see where I was. I'm going to go one north from here as well. Just explore that room. But where are you at? I'm going back to the portal room right now. But you're coming from the from the east flank. I'm actually on your side right now. I'm in the village room that I think you found next to the starter. Because I was just doing okay. a loop around those main room. Dude, there are there are two gilded POIs right in my face and three gilded POIs and coin stacks and I can't I can't do this. I gotta give you the stuff. Don't have time. Don't have time. Well, I don't have a POI, so I might just have to leave. I'm in the starter room right now. I'm going north just to see. I'm coming, if... I'm coming, I'm coming. Wait, 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 wait. I'm I'm right next to it. I think there's a dungeon in this. I'm I'm right to the east of the starter. In the tunnel. Did I see you? Did I see you? I'm running back right now. I think this might be a no-go for both of us. Ah, I just wasn't hey, how you doing? I wasn't looking Hello. for POIs like I should have been. I don't know what it was. I got distracted from the essence. There you go. There's the blood vials. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Uh, we can't really greed more. Ah, uh, get out. I guess. Dang. I'm gonna take one more room in front. I don't know. I don't know. Hold on. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Just wanna what are you look. doing? You're you greeting. You're greeting. I just want to look one more room. I want to look one more room real quick. Because if, like, if it's there, then we're good, but if not, I'll have time to run back and everything will be okay. But, like, what if it's here? Oh, that no, would be this insane. is another village room. Dude, the west one, the west flank was another village room. Yeah, I found that with, like, two and a half minutes left when I was going through. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't check if there was a portal room. Like, I don't have time. I wouldn't have time to loot the chest. I should have checked if there was a portal room at the very least, just to know. What if there was, like, I'm in the room 30 now, essence? I'm not gonna... I'm not going to dig down. Ooh. Yeah, it's the it's the essence you can get, dude. I'm fairly sure you uh you won the essence by far. <laughs> what were you looting primarily? Uh well, I I was stuck in that village room for like 8 minutes. Oh, fair <laughs> I enough. almost died to the spider. So, but no, I was I was very focused on the gilded to see if I could find the mega one. You like the survived? It's very nice, yeah. Woo! How many chests did you open? Mm. I opened... 64 chests, 7 of them were trapped. Well done. I did 51. Okay, alright. Little bit of low roll? Did you know about the two timers that you had for the completion of the scav vault? Uh, I don't think so, because he didn't watch that. That's also an interesting one. I don't feel like I'm rolling high on these at all right now. Twenty-five. All right. Pay nights. How many ores? Nine pay night ores. Fuck. That looked for that looks pretty good. That didn't look that great. Fuck. Black Opal?
What the fuck? <laughs> Where the hell would I go? Surely the black opal nets me a ton. Okay, it could have been worse. Oh my god. All right. Well, fuck me, I guess. Self love. <laughs> Someone just tell me it's not a me problem, so I feel better about things. Point four. Wow, I'm so happy about that. Tier two. Those are actually good. Those are actually really good. Seven armor on boots and soulbound. It was armor and soulbound. I mean, it was either going to be health and soulbound or armor and soulbound. But I'm down. I'm down for either. We don't have it on here. We lose two hearts, but, like, we already have, like, we're good, right? We got the nine health on this bad boy. If you didn't catch this earlier, uh, oh my god. 26 armor. What's the defense? 35! How many knowledge shards can you make? Quite a few. Don't think I'm gonna do that right now. Actually, you know, that's a pretty good point. Hey, guys. What if y'all took a break? You know what I mean? I appreciate the help with everything, but I think... I think I'm good. Because what if we threw down one of these bad boys and took advantage of that little cheaper compass, yeah? I don't mean to do that since day fucking one, man. Are you kidding me? Hey, craft me up one of those compasses. Let me see real quick. Run away with both of these. Let me make one of those. Thank you. And let me see one of those. Ooh. So we got a vault compass boy now. Um, okay. So here's the thing. This, I'm pretty sure for my own second sanity, is going to stay... Because it could go here, right? It could just, like, not go in my hotbar and everything's fine, right? Because we've got shulker box here, a quiver, shard pouch, shulker boxes, compressed another rack. It's kind of good as is. There is always the option of, instead, moving my quiver and all this up, right? And having my shovel in front of my pick... It's because the shovel doesn't get used too often inside of vaults. It's mostly the pickaxe that gets used. The shovel is kind of like a specialty tool. Unless we're running like a, um... I don't know. Unless we're doing like a... X mark room where I gotta alternate between the two. Or, like, there's a sand area on one of the POIs that I gotta alternate. So, like, you know, there's a couple, right? But I'm wondering if, like, you know, something like that... Could be good, and then if we're in the middle of a POI, we can just very quickly do that and swap between them, but otherwise, like, we can have the compass. I mean, that is to say, like, I don't even think, um, I don't even know if I need it inside of my hop bar, but just having it on me at all times does seem kind of nice, right? So I don't have to, like, keep checking my hop bar or, like, worry that I put it away. I don't know. I'm doing, I'm doing some thinking and some thinking, but, well, you know, you're... Oh boy. All right. The fuck? <laughs> well, the objective of the vault has very quickly changed twice. Hi! I have building blocks. Let's start from the top and work our way down. Cool. I haven't done this in a while. Now I can. 
Oh my god, you can. Triforce, never most of six months. I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you. What do we got? Oh! What the fuck? Oh god, that's bad. Well, we're stocking up for next vault. Did the pickering work on this? Never got to test it out. Dude, fucking sucks. Why is this room allowed to fill your inventory? I don't like that. Why are there so many items that your inventory can just get filled? What is wrong with me right now, dude? Omegas, by the way. Three. Three Omegas, by the way. My hands are actually incredibly slippery because I've got, like, a ton of grease on them because I just played after I ate McDonald's and I hate it. I'll probably wash my hands next time before I run the vault. Oh, this dude blows, man. It's not my greatest performance, okay? Listen, I only have a 13-minute PB. Leave me alone. Don't die? Yeah, but, like, what's the point anymore, you know? What the fuck is going on, man? I think it's actually, like, I know it sounded like Copium before, but I did ass think it's the grease. Like, my hands are extremely slippery. I feel like I can't really play at the moment. I can't get a grasp on my controller. The fuck am I using a controller? Bro, you own a mouse. You do not play on a console. Stop talking. Three Omegas, by the way. Fine, just make one more stack than you need. What is this dude doing? Yo, Canadian Greg! Thank you very much for the... gifted subs. I appreciate the fire bomb. Thank you so much. Where are the valuables? Blue? Blue? My bun. Two pinks.
Oh my god, man. Just forget about it, dude. Are you kidding me? All right, well and worth vault. At least we got a bunch of... Oh. I swear to God, I swear to God. Dropping a 20 bomb is an Omega. Praise the Lord. South facing vault, you know, boss opportunity, right? I still want to complete the boss. I wash my fucking hands first before I do. I don't know, man. This vault's cursed. I'm just gonna run through and try and find objectives and maybe try and slam down a little boss fight. Why am I marking rooms? I literally don't have to mark rooms anymore. I have a compass. Damn, with some chunky boys. Damn, with some chunky chests. They get a buff on POIs. We got a compass now. Did we hit a mine? <laughs> Not exactly. That didn't even show up on the thing. Just in the back of the room. I need to go a little juiced up on mana, to be honest with you. Looking extra finey today, Mr. Streamer. Thanks, Ms. Garmas. Appreciate the five. I should have five months, dude. Is there a quick way to regain mana? Nope. You need mana regen on your armor. That's the only way. Oh yeah, we hit a buff crystal room, but also they just nerf the cost of the compass by a significant amount. It now no longer takes the chromatic black iron ingots that was a total of 16 black opal. Now it's four vault diamonds, four netherite, and a compass. It's an incredibly easy uh, recipe now, which is interesting because I expected them to keep some kind of like higher value to it. Didn't know that they would mark it down that much. I guess the vault diamonds are a considerable thing because you'd rather want to use those on other stuff. What is up with the key pieces today? Holy. Hey there. Hey, boss. Still one shot on level 19. Sick. Oh, don't be doing that. Nice air. Hmm. Stay behind there, alright, bud? Thank you. Alright. 
I mean, common POI. Right? This skill. So you like the uh, piercing crossbow, huh? Yeah, you know, it's pretty good. Guild chests are just dumpies now. Which oh, means like an absurd amount of loot. Yeah, they are, uh, it's, they got a lot of stuff in them now. You are not wrong in the slightest about that. I was in the vault, capital D colon? No way, it's a capital D colon, not a colon capital D. There's still speedrunning crate like season two? There is, I think. There's speedrunning stuff. I don't know if it's specifically a crate. I think it is. I don't know if the contents of such crate have been discussed or uh, really talked about much. Because nobody has completed a speed run yet. To my knowledge, me and Abe are the only two people that have ever attempted one. Then out to the champions crate yet? No, I think they're working on like a pretty big update for it. I think they're also just kind of tied into like the idea of we want to give you something, but we don't want it to be progression based. So I think they're kind of trying to figure out like how it's going to work exactly. Hello there. Hello there. I'm spend my time doing this. All right. What the fuck? Hey, spiders surely can't climb anything, right? Okay. I, for some reason, really was not expecting any of them to be behind me. As I said that out loud, I'm like, actually, you know what? <laughs> so we'll be getting some ores from here. And that will be what we'll be doing this fall. Oh, God, alive. Ouch. I'm trying to proc them and then leave. So I can take them out in waves. Don't lag while this is happening, please. Gotta speed of scale. Time for this? How far away are you? I mean, I'm not that far away. I've, I've got the time for it. What the shit? Smile. Oh, the slimes, man. Oh my god! Don't want me doing that. Afterlife. This guy ran the ball with me and was like, I have a feeling now.
please depart from such poison ventures. I think we can probably start like uh, maybe mining ores now. That's a significant amount of pain, I. There is a significant amount of pain in this room. Other pickaxe? I don't know how to tell you this. Okay, well, they didn't all die, just things stopped moving, and I kind of assumed. I see the baby slime there, I'm just kind of ignoring him. Ain't bothering me. Not yet, at least. Told it's time to fuck off, and it was like, all right, <laughs> all right, man, sorry, Dan. My bad, my bad, my bad. Okay, there you are. Where exactly? Oh, I see. Whoa, my inventory is already full. What? Six minutes. We gotta get out of here relatively soonish. Can't spend too long here. Gonna have to depart in a moment. Not super happy about it. Really taking a liking to crystal rooms and the pain I and the gems that they offer, you know. I do have a vault compass for a reason, but I haven't tried getting back home with one yet, so I'm still not fully used to the idea. If that makes sense, you know. Oh, son of a bitch! I'm gonna try and get this. Extinguish it. And try and clear out this last layer. Grab the paint and go. Might be able to ignore those guys and just go now. That's good. I'm content with that. There's more pain I throughout the room, but I wanted those two specifically. Take me home, compass. Take me home. Time to have faith in the compass? Surely it, it's a good and reliable way to get back. 
if you can this flower season yeah yeah calm's in there I mean, the thing is, without the compass and also with, like, chat helping and just the system that we've been using, um, I've kind of already gotten pretty well versed in, like, how vault navigation has been for me, so, like, I kind of already understand where I am. I don't have time. Fuck. And after the crystal room, I'd be doing that, but I don't have time right now. I would need to clear out the entire room of any other mobs around the area. And then the fight, for all I know, could wind up me just running away or needing to evac and could take a considerable amount of time anyway. Damn. But I'm happy with the ores. I'm, I'm very content with the ores. Okay, cool. Cool. So... Yeah, that's easy enough to follow. Little anxiety reliever this boy is, you know? Not bad, not a bad tool. Not a bad tool at all. Oh, yeah. Morning, Wizard Watcher. How are you? How are you? It's more chill for my anxiety than anything else. <laughs> Falls and dies. Suffocates inside the fucking wall and dies. Yer, 10 painite ore. I didn't even go through the entire crystal room. There was still like, I think two batches of painite ore that I saw. We had 10 from that? So many key pieces, is that a bug? I don't think so. Maybe the in fact that I found two key pieces already, um, since the update, might need a little bit of tweaking, but... I mean, I already had some key pieces from just running a bunch of vaults before. I don't think I'm necessarily getting them at any supposedly infrequent amounts. Right. That'll do that. Not bad. Incredibly good. Bombing that's gonna be my problem more this season. It already is my problem more this season. Are you breaking the player ores? Why not? Nineteen off of ten. Not fantastic. Not horrible. Still no echo? That's sick. I love that. I love how rare echo seems to be. Alright, you guys already know what time it is. Gear crafting time. So as it stands, uh the chest plate needs an improvement. The boots are basic, but good armor. Legs are good armor, mana and soul bound, right? And the helmet is fantastic. The chest plate is tier one. This this boy could use some upgrades, so we're gonna craft a chest piece. Do we have any proficiency? Yeah, it was the first thing that we crafted. Off and it comes later. It's not very it's not much better. It's not much better at all. Wait until level twenty five? Ah, it's not why we play the game. Or scrap and a wild focus. All right. What's proficiency on that one? 0.7 increase. Can we do a little bit better on the second time around, please? Oh, man. Oh, there we go. Okay. That's already a pretty major improvement. I'm not going to want to be happy with it, even if it is. 
Uh, um, it's a tier 2 health buff with 6 armor. And the 9% mana regen. So the armor is the same. We'll lose the item rarity. Which I'm going to be honest. I'll be completely honest. I actually don't think I give a shit about item rarity right now. <laughs> It was cool to think about at the beginning of having really high item rarity stuff, but right now, man, all I care about is surviving and soulbound. That's, like, literally it. So that's not bad by any means. The mana regen... Plus 9%. Well, it's 0.75 mana regen per second. So that's... What would that increase it to? That would be 0.81 mana regen per second. So, you know, it could be a difference... If I was to reroll, what would what would basically come around on this, right? Because mana is a prefix, health is a prefix, armor is a prefix. Got to pick one. Suffix wise, I feel like mana regen is decent, and prefix wise, plus four health, tier two. That's good, you know. I think I'm not gonna waste my focuses. I think we're gonna be okay with that. Yeah, same amount of health, or same amount of armor. We get an extra two HP. I like that. Last fall of the night. Let's go. And it might end in death. <laughs> Alright, three ob vaults. I was kind of itching for possibly being able to fight a boss before I go to bed tonight. Alter chests, everybody. So about that level scaling. I dead ass get better items from a rare regular chest. I don't know about that one. I don't know about that one. Yeah, we're going boss hunting. I got my health potions, plenty of them. I'll also find an Omega Room or something that takes up a ton of time. I am kind of a sucker for ores at the moment. God, I hate you so much. This is not going to be worth it. Alright. Twenty-five mana. Why am I doing that? I have a compass. Maybe alter loot scales with favor. That'd be an interesting pitch. And I'm not really here to find out or want to change any favors up, you know? Hmm. Fuck. I no longer care. I don't think I care. The Vault Compass is a special compass that works for this dimension. It will always point toward the uh, center portal room. So you can use it as a way to get back. That's why I don't need to mark my exits anymore. Because if I'm ever worried... Really, the only, way, the only thing about marking an exit is like knowing if I've been in the room or not. Four altars already, man. That's impressive. Oh my god. Yeah, so I, I now remember and I'm reminding myself of why a scale one that uh <laughs> that bet we had. Living chests are pretty good for those things, yeah. 
Damn, the amount he would have sauced on me if he found that second village room, and if that second village room had a portal room. Ooh. You won? I didn't, though. 24 to 20? Nope. That was, uh... This scale may or may not have pre-jacked. Rampage, interesting. I misheard. Well, yeah, because it was initially, uh, oh, da oh, damn. Hey there, bud. Oh, you're gonna be annoying as shit to fight, aren't you? What are you down there for, man? I really gotta bring an anvil for these moments, dude. W's. Morning, Mr. Hutton. Chat. That's me. Oh my God! Good morning. Cleared out the hole. Never mind. Are you stuck in this room? Yeah, I already did. Morning, Nickel. Thank you very much. The eight. I'm not finding any obes. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I'm gonna be kind of sad if I don't get the opportunity to fight a boss. And kill a boss via an anvil. Might be a bit before people start getting that creative. But it'd be cool if it wasn't. You play Valorant? I don't. Valorant never really caught my attention in the way that CSGO did. I think I was looking for a CSGO game type game when I was aiming for Valorant. And now this one I can't be asked to learn locations and columns. You'd be a chamber main? I mean, yeah. Chamber's fucking hot. Who wouldn't? Called it. Okay, man. Living and frail. The trade-off's worth it. How about Overwatch? Never really gotten to Overwatch either. Hello, are you a thing? Oh my god! I'm dungeon looks because I'm trying to fight a boss! It would remiss everyone to the prime. Hopefully I didn't butcher your name at all. Edermis. Thank you for the prime. There was no you after the I. I apologize. Where are the obelisks? What the hell? Hello, friend. Thank you for allowing me to not have to spend mana in this room. Boy, hey, big 
trident, boy. Oh, do you not carry a trident? Oh. <laughs> Never mind. Why does a boss not have a trident? I mean, I guess... Why would this dude be the one who fought anyway, you know? You guys boys for that. I think he's supposed to? Oh, no. <laughs> Damn, first time I've seen, uh, seen that. Cool model. I like it, I like it. Ax him? I don't think you understand. The amount of damage and stun lock that would happen if that guy hit me a single time. If I would even live, for that matter. Last time I saw him, he had one but didn't throw it. Interesting. Man, but like, that's not... Yeah, you know I'm good, man. I could be looting. I could get some coin. I could get the altar. But, like, I'm trying... Trying to do one objective here. I got speed for a reason. Should not be spending my mana on that right now. Where does Mohawk go? He had a Mohawk? So many altars. Easy. Jesus Christ. Ooh, the Vault Diamonds were a good pull from that. I enjoyed that very much so. Fourteen minutes, man. I don't... How come I haven't had to look for either of these? I want to have to head back home. I want to do some prepping and killing. Or at least attempt it and have some time to get back home if I need. So it's it's got to appear soon. That could be it. I was going to say that if it was it, that would be a very interesting place to do a boss. To summon a boss. I think that'd be an immediate right click and dipski. Morning, Monte. Thoughts have been pretty good. Thoughts been pretty good today. This feels like it wouldn't be too bad of a room, honestly. Oh, God. Never mind. No pizza game, that's for the 47. Thank you. That was a lot of meat. A POI was packing. Oh my, oh my god. Frickin, frickin, frickin. This guy's rolling the crazy loot today. Jesus. Do you even sleep? Yes, plenty. Okay, here's the room. Do I like the room? Um, I don't know. This looks like a pretty fucky room, but it's the room that we are offered, so I have to respect that and, and deal with it. 
Let's do a little clearing of the POIs. I don't care about the altar. I was waiting for it to spawn, but I don't care about the altar. I don't know why I would. I'm mining the gold. Chris Mars first. Yep, that's the that is the plan. That is the plan. You guys are doing your best, and that's what matters. Good night. Okay. Okay, just, um, you know, that's cool. Don't get hurt too badly right now. I really want to keep the amount of mana that I have. Fuck. Wasting time by getting hit right now. Wasting time, wasting time. Something just exhausted above me. Or below me, rather. Oh, yeah, hello. Well, we definitely have some spawner locations. I don't care about the life altar. I don't care if it's an easygoing altar. I don't care about it. I do care about the guilds, though. I will be taking that one. Okay, the room actually goes down very low, so this could very well be a not great venture for me, but I've already committed, so here we are. Were you chilling in the air gap? That's incredible. Nice job. The final POI. Take a time to fight you at a distance, so I don't have to regen anything. Thank you. Alright, are we good to get uh, our ass kicked? Chat, this could end very poorly, but I am tired of being afraid. Yeah, this could actually be uh, really horrible. This is a very terrible room. Um, what level up from here is good? Just out back this way? Okay. Did we already clear that off? We already cleared that off. Yeah, this room's... Yeah. God, this room's terrible. But maybe it won't be that bad, you know? Maybe it won't be... That bad. So let's do a little clearing of inventory then. Let's get prepped. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, so... Pickaxe isn't really needed, I don't think. Um, you, you, and you. Good, okay. Uh, pearls, great, because we're gonna drink this, and then we're gonna have three spots for the, uh... Splash pots. That's basically how it's gonna go. Okay. Am I nervous? Of course I am. Of course I'm. Fucking terrified. But I think I'm a little bit more gear now than last time. <sighs> Christ, am I sure about that? I don't know if I am. So that's just really bad, man. It's going fine, though. It does damage you a little bit. I'm just getting my shit kicked in, man. Fuck, 
No, bro, I can't. I literally, I literally can't. Nope, I can't. I can't do it. I literally can't do it. That is so much damage, and I just am literally unable to heal quickly enough with my cooldown. Oh my god, you're still on my ass! God, man. Ugh. I mean, this guy was talking to me, he said like, you know, tank, rampage, all these things, execute, like that's how you build for a boss fight. I built myself to be speedy. Right? Like that's just, that's just how my build is. It's just like, the room is a really big deal because he's teleporting a ton on me because I'm having to shoot him and all that kind of stuff. And yeah, it's just, oh, don't get close to him again. I feel like our armor is like pretty decent as well at the moment. I don't know, I was getting low on mana, I couldn't regen quickly enough. I'm at three levels health, but mind you, I did error a lot in that because I put my... I shouldn't do it, man. I put my, um... I put my axe into my first slot. And I cross one in my second slot because I was just moving stuff around. And I'm not used to clicking one to go to my weapon. I'm used to clicking two. So a bunch during that I was going to my crossbow to melee him. Yeah, it was just not not good on that end. Could have been a lot better. But I still think even with that, that like I don't know. Might need to get a stronger weapon. Might need to just figure out heavier damage. Because my axe deals what? 14? You can get a 19 damage axe. Actually, we're tiered, we're up at this level. 10 to 14 damage is still only, uh... It's still only tier 1. Look at that vault compass, though. Look at that. Look at that vault compass, though. Shit. Okay, cool. Let's uh, run down really quick with the last la raffle. Laffle. Case of it. See you in the gladiator arena. All right. Let's round up. I think we already did the, uh, the only sub arena that we had. We did that earlier. All right, what do we got? Poison immunity. Man, I could take that. Ooh. Epic good old vanilla shield. 27% block chance. Not bad at all. Uh, I'll take the block chance. I immediately regret taking the block chance. High attack damage. Three chaining on decent attack damage. Also the same thing there. What do we have? Poison 2 plus Cloud? 3 chaining? 50% increased damage on 49 attack damage, so that would be about what? What would that be? About 56 damage in total then? Probably about 56 damage in total, whereas this is uh, about 50 damage with chaining. It's by full. Critical strike chance. So it would probably be the Vault Sword on the left there. I'd imagine. Alright, let's we'll call it our weapon. What about armor? 6 armor, 12 health. Man, I really picked a bad shield. <laughs> How was I to have known? 6 armor, 12 health. 13 armor, 4 health. Block chance on the chest plate. Ooh, that's nice. Okay. Legs, 5 armor. Chest plate, 11 armor. Jesus. Helmet will probably be the ideal. 2 speed. I'm good. So we have a helmet and chest plate. Mana and mana regen. Plus 1.88 reach. Damn, Tenos. God damn. God damn. Everything else here kind of sucks because I have helmets and chest plates already. I already have a weapon as well, too. And I already have an offhand. Maybe the helmet's better than what I already have. I wish I could check and see what I have. Grab the helmet. Okay. Uh, which helmet's better? 16 armor and 12 armor, 6 health? 
Six percent res. Probably go the extra three hearts. Shouldn't be bad, hopefully. Bonus mana and region to work in the arena. I know. Oh, I know. It's not my first time running an arena. I just was looking at some of the modifiers because, you know, looking at gear that we can get in the future is kind of cool. It's kind of neat. All right, you sons of bitches. You paid the beer. Let's give everybody a show. Fuck, that's a lot of damage. Well, I'm completely nude. I have 18 armor. <laughs> anyway. Surely this goes well for me. Server's doing a little hitching because we've got a few people on. Surely that won't be the death of me. Oh, the poison. Poison things are doing a little bit of work. Right. We got under 25, less than a full wave. There's only a couple speedy boys, and the rest of them kind of sit still. Okay, cool. That's, I think, our fourth arena, or fourth champion crate in, in uh, a row at this point. <laughs> Which champion crates do we have? We have three? We have four now. Hey, whenever they make these into a thing, that'll be real great for us. Oh my god, man. I lost three gold nobles worth of potions, but I learned something at the very least. I'm off for the night. Have a great one. Appreciate it, y'all. Take care.